Before we go any further, let me give you a little update about this channel. The channel is not dead, although I know it kind of looks like it. I am not dead, I'm pretty much alive and I'm doing a lot of stuff, but I just can't find the time to edit film videos for my YouTube channel. I'm currently editing a few of them, BTS videos that should be released this summer, but today, right now, we are going to talk about the DCX3 by Viltrox, an incredible field monitor, spoiler. Let me tell you why you should seriously consider it if you are currently looking for a field monitor for your filmmaking needs. around $300. This one is actually priced under $300 and usually getting a reliable, robust field monitor at that price is not that easy. That's why I was really, really surprised the first time I opened the box and actually used it. Obviously, this is not a long-term review. I've had it in my hands only for a couple of days. So keep that in mind, but still, my first impressions about this monitor are more than positive. More than positive. What does that even mean? First off, this monitor has an impressive 2000 nits brightness. That means you can use it in super bright conditions without any visibility issues. No more struggling to see your screen in broad daylight. It's got all the pro tools you need like focus speaking, false color, and zebra patterns. These are essential for getting that perfect shot every time. interface is a breeze to navigate through, adjusting settings or finding what you need is quick and easy. The screen is top notch, giving you HD visuals with 4K HDMI SDI in and out. Every detail is crystal clear. Weighing only 350 grams, this monitor is perfect for on the go use. With multiple power supply options, it's ready for long shoots. Plug it or use an NPF battery, it's your call. Fly away, fly away. Fly away with me as time It has advanced heat dissipation technology. I used it recently on a very hot day and it didn't slow me down. No overheating so far. But the first thing I noticed with the DCX3 is the build quality. A well thought out design that will probably handle the rough and tumble of field work. And you know what? It comes with all the accessories you need right out the box, a battery and a carrying case. I 
had to mention it because the last modder I reviewed on this channel didn't have all these accessories included. If you are right now looking for a monitor for your filmmaking needs, well, you should take a closer look at the DC-X3 by Veltrox. I am using it right now. It's up there. It is my go-to film monitor at the moment. If you wish to learn more about this product, please click on the links down below. I am, like I said earlier in this video, currently working on editing new BTS videos for this channel. The first one will be published next week. And of course, there will be an article with a longer version for the blog. So be sure not to miss these future releases. I guess that will catch you in the next one under that heat. Take care, please. And until next time, have a good one.